in the north of Syria which violate international law. Gomes, um minuto. Thank you, Mrs. Ana Gomes, one minute. Está a violar todos os critérios de Copenhaga, assim como todas as obrigações. Well, I think uh, all the Copenhagen criteria, all the obligations that Turkey has uh, as a member of the Council of Europe are being violated. Uh, journalists in prison, prison closing down the media, instrumentalizing the judiciary and constantly putting more and more pressure on its people. I mean, this is a disaster. And I don't think it can be separated from what's being done in Syria. Turkey's bombing civilians, attacking the Kurdish forces who bravely fought against al-Qaeda. The Erdogan regime has basically infiltrated Syria and Iraq. They're not acting in legitimate defense. They're simply committing crimes against civilians. There is a very dangerous military escalation being carried out by Turkey. They're not respecting its NATO co their NATO commitments. And as the European Union, we need to strongly criticize Turkey for these violations. They're compromising the possibilities for a negotiated solution in Syria. Thank you. Thank you very much. A year and a half after the coup, we are still condemning Erdogan for his encroachments on the fundamental freedoms of his own citizens, both inside and outside the national territory.